But next year at five, a road construction project over on the west side of the state just got very interesting. Yeah, crews spotted something while digging, and it turned out to be pieces of history predating the state of Michigan. The discovery had some researchers from U of M racing out to Kent City near Grand Rapids to help determine exactly what was in the ground. Victor Williams live with more on the discovery. Victor. Oh yeah, Karen and Devin, this is a discovery that has been centuries in the making, and it really shows us a sneak peek at what life was like in Michigan over 13,000 years ago. Lots of parts and pieces uh, as they began to excavate this animal, and it'll in fact be a little tricky to identify everything. U of M paleontology professor Daniel Fisher speaking on an amazing find that goes all the way back to the Ice Age bones belonging to what's believed to be about a 10-year-old mastodon. The interesting thing about this particular mastodon is that it turns out it's a young individual. The discovery may not have happened if it wasn't for drain work that had to be done. This animal was discovered when um, folks working for the Kent County Drain Commission were putting in a new culvert. At this point, not all of the prehistoric animal has been recovered. So far, we have something like two thirds of this animal. So we have something like maybe 200 bones. Um, that's an estimate, certainly. Since this is a young animal, many of its bones are not yet fused together in the form that they'll take uh, when the animal is an adult. And since Professor Fisher has done extensive work on Michigan mastodon discoveries in the past, he says this one is groundbreaking because it tells us so much more than what we've already been able to learn about the creatures. This animal will tell us things about mastodon development that we wouldn't be able to get from an animal that was fully adult in which all of these separate parts had fused together. Those bones will soon be on display at the Grand Rapids Public Museum. Victor Williams, Local 4. It'll be great fun to see. That's a great story. All right, Victor.